So basically, the, um, our project is the EpiViews project. So it's exploring patient impact and value in epilepsy wearable seizure monitoring. So this project basically revolves around a wearable wrist-worn device called the Empatica Embrace 2. And it's the first um, wrist-worn wearable device of its kind to have FDA approval in the detection of tonic-clonic seizures. And it works by linking to your phone and sending sending an alert to your caregiver if it was to detect a seizure. So a very quick rundown of how it works is it has a few sensors in it. So it has an accelerometer, which basically means it detects motion, and it has an electrodermal sensor, which basically detects the electrical current on your skin. And through an algorithm that um, M M Empatica has programmed, it is able to detect a, it is able to detect a seizure. Um, now, I'll preface it by saying it's not designed to predict seizures, it's only designed to detect them. And it's it works with the goal of hopefully alerting your caregiver and expediting the care you might need um, if you were to have a seizure. Now, the, the watch itself, while it has FDA approval, um, there's not a whole lot of research done into it. A, a lot of the research was done in-house, so this is, this is the first um, research of its kind to basically validate the watch and to make sure it's actually reliable, whether it's accurate and make sure it'll have benefit for the people it's designed for. So there's two parts to this um, research. So the first part is where we basically um, validate the watch's um, accuracy and re reliability. So how we do that is we'll go to the epilepsy monitoring unit in Beaumont and we'll get people who are on um, video EEGs, which is the gold standard for epilepsy um, seizure detection. And we'll get them to wear this watch alongside it. And through that, we'll be able to have a general idea of how accurate the watch is, how reliable it is, um, whether it's able to um, detect certain other types of seizures, whether it misses some. Um, and we'll be, we'll be working in the epilepsy monitoring unit to achieve that. So, this, and the second part of the, the project is once we've validated the watch, once we've made sure it's accurate and reliable in accordance to what has been claimed, um, we're hoping to have a longitudinal study. So that's basically a study done over a longer period of time. And during that, we'll get people to wear the watch and basically live with it and we'll be able to determine um, their experience with it, how, how basically how it's like to live with the watch, any issues that they found, how it makes them feel, and also whether or not they found benefit either in the form of um, clinical benefit in that it, it, it significantly impacts their um, monitoring of their seizures and it helps them manage it or even for reassurance that they they're able to live with their epilepsy without the concern of having a seizure and not having someone be aware of it. Yeah, so what our research is hoping to find new information. So this is the first time a study is being done on a FDA approved wrist, wrist worn device. So obviously we want to find out whether or not it lives up to the claims that um, that the manufacturer um, has claimed and also whether it's um, it's accurate and reliable and it helps people to um, basically manage their condition. So whether or not, um, well, we'll find out whether it improves their quality of life, whether it just gives them that reassurance. I think those are all very important things. So in that sense, we do. I do want to highlight that this is quite a very human focused study. So we might, there's always a chance with this kind of study that there might not be any immediate clinical benefit, but that doesn't necessarily mean that the watch is um, useless or it's not able to be recommended. Um, if you find that the watch improves a person's quality of life, gives them reassurance about living with their condition, then that's still a very real and tangible benefit. And that's what our project seeks to find out. 